Hi, this is Rowan, and this week's video, I'm going to introduce you to my cats. Nigel. Nigel was, oh, he was a kitten when he came to live with me. He was abandoned by his previous owner on my old street in Lansing in October of 2012. He was approximately four months old at the time, and he's been with me ever since. He's such a sweet boy. He's very shy with everybody but me, and interestingly, my, uh, my the young man I'm cohabitating with at the moment, he likes Isaac for some reason. Nigel is very playful, um, but, uh, uh, he's not going to demonstrate that right now because he is not my trained monkey. M Nigel also thinks he is my boyfriend. He's very creepy and he likes to watch. Let's put it that way to keep this work safe, right? Right, Nigel, but he's very creepy and he likes to watch. Yes, he does, but he's a sweet boy and I love him. Yes. Don't you think you're my boyfriend? Okay. Oh, oh, no play? No play? No? Am I being annoying? Am I? Just a little bit. Do you love me? Do you love me? Okay, not now. Phoebe. This is Phoebe. She is... Hi, now. Phoebe is... Was adopted about... Two and a half years ago, when she was about two and a half years old, she is approximately the same age as Nigel, but they're not brother and sister because I adopted them at different times. Um, Phoebe, Phoebe, Phoebe's being a pain in the butt right now. She's kind of chubby, we can see that, but last she was at the vet, they said it's not too bad, it's not too bad, just you know, make sure she doesn't gain too much more weight. She is not quite as playful as the boys, and she's ignoring me right now, Phoebe. But she's very, very sweet. She's a big cuddler and a lap beast, and when Mr. Midnight died in March, she was there for Nigel, because Nigel and Mr. Midnight were buddies, and she was there to console Nigel, and now she's trying to get back at... Oh, no, she's, she's off. She's done with the interview today. All right. I guess that's it. Phoebe, Phoebe's much sweeter than... <laughs> but she's, she's done with my bullshit. She's done with so much bullshit. <laughs> All right. Maybe another time, Phoebe. This is Murnau. He is about eight months old. He's... Uh, he was a adopted in October and I love him very much. He is allergic to dust and so he's a little sniffly right now because I haven't vacuumed um, very recently but he's okay. He's very very playful for a kitten. In fact, he spent most of the morning running around like an insane little monster like kittens do. Yeah, as you see, he's got a peachy orange collar with a tag. He doesn't yet have his microchip, so when that happens, I'm going to get him a new tag. I adopted him from the same people from whom I adopted Phoebe, and... Um, I adopted him because back in March, I had a cat named Mr. Midnight, and Mr. Midnight died from kidney failure, and he used to play with Nigel all the time, and Phoebe indulged Nigel for a while, because she's not quite as playful, um, but after about six months, she was having enough, she had enough of Nigel's bullshit and I decided, you know, let's go with an older kitten and somebody who could keep up with Nigel. And it's been working out lovely so far. Oh, oh, are we going to sneeze? No, not right now. Okay. 
Uh, he's, he's pointed away from the flesh, but you see he's got these tufty little ears and a big fluffy tail. And the rest of his furs is so long and smooth and shiny and silky. And he's a very, very beautiful kitten. And he's going to be so, so pretty when he's all grown up. Do you want to see your pretty face? Yes, we do. Oh, yes, we do. We love you, Moon, now. And so those were my cats. Um, Nigel, Nigel, I, I named him because that's what stuck. That's what stuck. <laughs> um, he went through a couple names before Nigel stuck, but, um, including Squeaker. He was Squeaker for a little while, but Nigel's the name that stuck. Uh, Phoebe was named by the people I adopted her from. And Murnau was originally named Dazzle by the same adoptive people, so uh, if you're one of my friends on Facebook, you know, there's a couple very old pictures of him, but he never responded to Dazzle, but when I was playing Nosferatu, 2, um, the original 1922 silent vampire film, he did seem responsive to the name Murnau after the director, so Murnau is the name that stuck, and that seems to be the name that's sticking. Uh, so, yeah, the boys were just, that's what stuck, and I guess Phoebe, she, her name just kind of stuck. There she is again, maybe? Oh, beautiful Phoebe. Beautiful Phoebe. She is a cuddle monster, but she's a little, she, she does, she, <laughs> when, when she's done with your bullshit, she is done. <laughs> And she's a done, I guess, right now. So, uh, that, that is my cats. And we can see Phoebe. Oh, yep, she's done with bullshit. All right. So, oh, oh, she <laughs> she's letting me pet her right now. No, she does not want me pointing the camera at her. <laughs> but I've got very sweet cats and I love them. And if you, if you, uh, be, you know, I don't care too much if you just don't like cats. I mean, you don't have to love cats, but if you don't like animals at all, and if you, especially if you're mistrusting of cats, well, I guess more especially if you don't like any animals at all, but I don't know. I, I'm suspicious of you if you, if you don't like cats. Don't at least like cats. You know, cats are great. And contrary to common belief, they love us very much. So, um, you know, my cats are there for me when other people aren't, so I love them. And yes, they're all black, and I have a couple friends who have a hard time telling Nigel and Phoebe apart, but they look very different. Nigel's got a very broader face, and Phoebe's got a very, you know, like, very smaller, pinchy, pinchier nose. Um, but yeah, those are my cats. That's sweet. Right, we've finally... Got some Phoebe. Look at little Phoebe. Oh, she's so pretty. She's so pretty. Yes, she is. And she's on my lap. Doing what she's best known for. Yes. We love Miss Phoebe. We love her so much. Oh, yes, we do. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love you. I love you. Wait, wait. There we go. There we go. Oh, kissy, kissy. Kissy slurp. Are we going to do it again? Oh. No? Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. No? 